Hello friends, this is Ramana. Today I will show a demo on how to check database size in SQL Server. While we are working on the database uh, being a developer, so um, we have to know the space, uh, how much space is there in the database, uh, on a particular database to take action on these things. So for that reason, I will show how to check database in SQL Server. So size of the database. So there are three ways to check the database sizes. One by using the SQL statement. And second one by executing the store procedure. Executing store procedure. System store procedure. You can see store procedure. And third one by implementing the by using the SQL server management studio as G, GUI that is graphical user implementation. So I will show one after other. First I will write the SQL statement. So here if you want to select the database of a there is this um, there is a table called sys dot databases select star from sys dot c when you click the sys already came some intelligence it is here. it is uh, asking to prompt you to select i am selecting sys dot databases so he, if you select this one so here you find different names of the databases and different stuff all this when it was created what is the collation name all these things is appear so here in this table we don't have any size related to size of the database. We don't have size of the database is, is appear in different table that is called sys dot master master underscore files. Here you find the size of the database. See here. See if you see the here size. We want to convert it to uh, MB size in later. So the, this size will appear in the one one table, but the database ID is there. But in this database, we have name and ID as well. So by this, we need to do some joining. We have to join both this table on object ID, on object ID or database ID. So here in the in sister databases, you find database ID as well as in system dot master files also. You find database ID. So by joining the, these two tables on database ID. So, so here on condition on on sister database whole table all sister database dot database dot id database underscore id equal equal to Start master files dot database id. So I joined both these tables. Now I want to group by group by on database name, sister database name, sister database basis dot name. Order by also by also sister database name. So here in select statement make this sister database name as a select column giving alias name as database name database name. So here we need to do some mathematical calculation. So we need to convert. So I already shown the size is in master dot file see here this is the size of the um, database but here we don't have the database name first i want to convert this i want to convert it into integers size is showing an integer i want to convert it to bare care
as I want to convert into MB size as space occupied. So if you run this one, see here, here I, I want to show my databases here. I have apart from four databases, four system databases, I have Adventure Works, Healthcare, Hollywood Movie, Sample, Soccer underscore World Cup, Sports, Exercise TV. All these are databases. See here, if the database has specified with with its size, the, that is occupied. So far, it is occupied. Adventure Works 352 MB, Healthcare 16 MB, Hollywood Movie 16 MB, Master 6 MB. These are system database MSDB sample, Temp DP everything. Soccer sample database 144 MB. So this is how you need to check the size of your database by writing by joining two tables. So see, in sister databases, there is system na database name and database ID is there. Whereas size is uh, exists in the sys dot master underscore files. So we need to join both these um, tables with uh, database ID and convert them uh, into uh, size is the integer. We want to convert those with var uh, care and these and do doing some calculation divided by 1024 which is equal to 1 megabyte so this is how you need to do by one method by using the t sql method so i am copying this one and then next one is executing the store procedure so the, 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 there is a one store procedure called that is this is the system store procedure sp underscore space user if you execute the store procedure you will get uh, i selected the sample that's why i am getting the sample database sample database and uh, uh, this is the user size this is the uh, uh, remaining data size here so if i change it the uh, adventure works database there you find the different numbers here 352 MB is already used and 62.72 is unused. And just you need to select your database and execute this query, execute this store procedure, you will get the details of that particular database. So, this is one way to get. So, I already, this is my sample database, I am executing. So here you find 144 MB and 66.13 MB as unallocated space. This is by using the executing the store procedure. You can you came to know the size of your database. Third one is SSMS. Just by right clicking on your database and go to properties. See here, this is I am using sample database. Here, size is 144. Here, the, in executing short procedure also, it will it will get the same. So, you can see space available. That is unallocated space. You can get 66.13. By these three ways, you can get, you can came to know how much size a you already used it and how much size will remain unused of your databases. So we have to use the three term by executing the TSQL statement and by executing the store procedure and by using the SSMS as well. You can get the, you can directly know how the database size so far used and how much is left in a, in a particular database. So thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.